Right, so I filled up the hot liquor ton and uh, got it going. So uh, sorted out the measurements on the sight glass. Yeah, yeah. And uh, there you can see there's a little dimple in the middle. So it's all working well. So I had uh, a slight weep coming from the sight glass. I uh, just found I hadn't done the nut up on that. And uh, and on the tap, coming from in there, actually I've still got a bit of a one there. But that's coming from the, I think it's the nut on the back of the tap there. You can see I've got some PTFE tape around it. And uh, yeah, it's just weeping slightly. You can see the whirlpool going quite well. That's good. So I'm going to chuck some PBW in there in a minute and then uh, give that a clean and then I'll get that transferred over to the mash tun then. So I've had this uh, whirlpool in for quite a while now with the PBW in. So I'm just now transferring it over using the herms into the mash tun and dropping uh, it in there. So I've got this false bottom uh, and a bit of um, overflow pipe on it. Now, why I've done that is because I'm a bit worried that it might, I know it's not, it, it might slide away from that to the centre where I'm going to be drawing from for the uh, for the herm. So that's going to help me keep it in the middle. I suppose also as well, if, if I do get a stuck mash, I could just blow down there, but I think that's a bit unlikely because I always use oak husks in there, in the mash, so uh, so I don't think that will happen. So this, this hose is just temporary, it's just to recirculate it from the pump back in, because I've got no heating elements in there, so it's going to uh, go through the herms and uh, keep the temperature there while I just give it a clean. And, uh, and that's that. And so, uh, just about giving it, finish the cleaning, and then give it a good rinse. So, got the rooms on that control panel. So, I'm going to have another control panel up around here ish. Um, that'll be solely just to control the HLT. So, that's going to be in another video. So, uh, Thanks for watching and uh, catch you soon.